So guys, how do you transfer your WhatsApp from one phone to another phone? You're going to see three dot line over here. Click on that and then you're going to tap to settings. Inside settings, you're going to tap these chats. Inside that, at the bottom, you're going to tap on chat backup. Now, you can see here it is. The backup will be done to the Google Drive. So every device you logged in with a Gmail account. Now you're going to select the account. So click on this select account. Yes, you can see Google account. So just select that. So you can see here you have an option. You're going to select the account where you would like to take a backup. Which particular Gmail account you would like to take a backup. You can see I've selected account where I would like to save the backup. Now just go up and you're going to click on backup. So here at the bottom, even if you want, you can include and exclude the video. If you want to take a backup of a video also, you can just uh, turn it on and it will back up your videos along with the chat and messages. If you don't want to back up the video, you can just turn it off and take a backup. You can see down hundred percent. Now, now let's say this is my new phone where I do not have a WhatsApp. Now I'll go to the Play Store and download a WhatsApp. Now from the Play Store, I'll install the WhatsApp. So new phone will be installing the WhatsApp. So before we open the WhatsApp, make sure your device is logged in with the same email where you have taken the backup. In your previous device, you have taken the uh, backup at uh, a particular email address on a Google Drive. It's a, some gmail.com, uh, something at the rate of gmail.com. So log in your new device with the same email account before we open the WhatsApp. Let's say your device is logged in with a different email account. What are you going to do? You're going to add one more email. So you're going to open the settings in your phone and then you're going to go to accounts. So find somewhere account, different phone has a different arrangement. Now you're going to see already logged in with a one email. Let's say you have taken the backup at different email. Your previous phone was logged in with a different email. In that case, you don't have to worry. You're just going to click on add account. Now you're going to choose uh, which account. Let's say you, whichever account, wherever you have taken, you have taken the backup at Google Drive, then you're going to choose Google. Now here you can add an email to the account. Now once you've installed the WhatsApp, once you've added an account where you have taken the backup, you're going to open the WhatsApp. You're going to click on agree and continue. Now you're going to add your phone and verify your WhatsApp. You're going to see over here, it's going to prompt you a message, click on continue. To find and restore your backup from a Google Drive, Allow access to your contact. So click on continue. So you're going to allow it. So it can ask you access to your photo. Click on allow. So you're going to see backup found. So the size is 1.1 GB. So almost uh, all backup. Now click on restore. Now you can see it is restoring backup. Done. It's a 4,565 message restores. Really is. So guys, if you this is the easy way you can just transfer your WhatsApp from one phone to another phone. If you like this video, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Have a good day.